Years passed, no tears fell, no death knell reached the golden shores they trod. Another love story without With a happy, happy ending. ending. Time works differently in the other world. She's gone, and even then I just keep reading. But it's always been my way of looking for answers, processing information. I can think of worse ways. Okay, sie ist weg. My grandma introduced me to these old legends when I was just a kid, in between stories of what she could still remember of her childhood in the old country. Weird mix of doggerel and artistry. The elemental imagery is evocative, but the language and structure are a bit quaint. Still, I've always been drawn to things that are kind of both good and bad at the same time. Maybe because that's so like life. My grandma introduced me to these old legends when I was just a kid, in between stories of what she could still remember of her childhood in the old country. Why? I might just as well stay here. I should really stay. I'm so tired anyway. I prefer the darkness inside right now. There's nothing for me out there. Ja, ich weiß ehrlich gesagt jetzt nicht, was tun. Wie gesagt, ist etwas seltsam. I kept saying I'd paint these chairs, add some color to this place. One more thing I never got around to. When did we let this window get so gunked up? There didn't seem to be much reason to keep it clean. Just overgrown bushes outside, brambles and thistles. All those moments we sat at this table, laughing, smiling, simply looking in each other's eyes. Will we have them again someday? Okay, sehen wir uns mal die Bücher an. Someone said, work and love are the only things that ever really happened to us. Was it Freud or Marilyn Monroe? Did I let my work destroy my love? Writing was so all-consuming for me, and I made so little headway in all this time. Es wird immer dunkler, desto mehr wir erforschen. I want to hurl the whole damn lot into the lake, or just tear at the pages until the wind sweeps them away. Some of these started a mildew long ago. Nothing gold can stay. Frost. Words, those damn words, my whole life's been consumed by them. Now I have none left to say. All of this, these pathetic souvenirs from our relationship, they're all lies. Ich glaube, es wird etwas dunkler, als ich erwartet hätte. I couldn't care less about this damn thing. torture myself trying to remember. I'm too upset to even think straight. I hate her so much. Das Liebe wird schnell Hass. All of this, these pathetic souvenirs from our relationship, they're all lies. I couldn't care less about this damn thing. torture myself trying to remember. I'm too upset to even think straight. I hate her so much. Sit down, we need to talk. When did it go so wrong? This was supposed to be a... We weren't supposed to fight here. You just don't get it, do you? You never do. All of this, these pathetic souvenirs from our relationship, they're all lies. I couldn't care less about this damn thing. Why torture myself trying to remember? Okay. 
Okay. She actually threw this at me once. She could have killed me. That's how the bedroom window got that crack. Here's your stupid omelet. Oh yeah. Beziehungskrise am Start. Heavy damn thing. Cast iron. I'm too upset to even think straight. A part of me still thinks she'll forgive me and come back. But I've lost all hope now. Do I deserve to be forgiven? What about all the things she did and all the things she said? Words and dreams may be enough for you, but you know what? You'll get a chance to test that soon because I've had enough. I hate her so much. Und die Kinder müssen höchstwahrscheinlich leiden. All of this the I couldn't care less about this damn thing. Oh. It's just a bunch of schmaltzy junk. A shrine to naivety. I don't see anything else of value. I should just destroy this useless junk. But not even the venom inside me gives me strength. Why torture myself trying to remember? I'm too upset to even think straight. Her jewelry box. What is it doing here? I hate her so much. All of this... these... pathetic souvenirs from our relationship. They're all lies. I sit here on the train, taking me to my final farewell to the ones who brought me to this world. I see the smiling couples on their way to new adventures and think, that used to be us. We had joy and laughter and friends once, but a memory is not the thing itself. You're very good at letting things you don't want to face slip off you. You continue as if nothing has changed, lost in your own lifeless world. Words and dreams may be enough for you. You know what? You'll get a chance to test that soon. I question how I once saw things. How much of what I thought we had were my own feelings, and how much of your manipulation. Because you are so very good with words, aren't you? You knew how to use them when we met, and for the longest time, I went along with the romantic whirl you conjured up around our shabby, isolated existence. Oh, it took me long enough to see it for what it was. And there were these moments that you swept me off on foolish flights of fancy, when I threw myself into your fantasies. You wove your spell, plying me with your magic and with wine in equal measure, and I was taken in like the lost little girl I was. Do you realize all the pain you've caused me? They say if you have to ask whether someone loves you, you already know the answer. Protestations to the contrary can no more convince me any more than I can make my own mother or father draw breath again. Your aloofness tells a different story. Es wird immer spannender. I no longer know what you're thinking. With my parents gone and with your refusal to even accompany me in my time of need, something broke. Or maybe it happened long ago, but I never saw it so clearly before, even after everything. I don't make you feel comfortable? Really? That's all you have to say? I won't waste any more life waiting for things that'll never come. Of course, that's what you expect me to do. Play the good wife so no one will laugh at you for being the failure you are, to shield you from the truth of your existence. Lost in your books and vapid verse, blithely drifting into the mists of time, as if not even a footnote, when you could be raking at it if you'd only used your words for anything other than personal indulgence. You talked and talked about your path, the winter blueness of my eyes, all that nonsense, and the years rolled by, the seasons came and went, on and on, you pursuing your dreams that will never be, lost in your damned words, looking for clues you'll never find. I'm sure you're doing it even now with your rotting books. You took the best years of my life, and gave only empty words in return. We've gone as far as we can, and something's got to give. Us. Okay, er hat sie anscheinend etwas vernachlässigt wegen den Büchern. I couldn't care less about this damn thing. I sit here on the train. I know. Why torture myself trying to remember? Changeable man, insolent wretch. <laughs> Sounds like Serena, all right. Her father's realm. She was a daughter of the Celtic sea god Mananan. Oh, what was it? Machler? Okay, here can man noch nichts tun. Ah. 
I should tear all her filthy, disease-ridden clothes apart and burn them! Everything she wore, just to lure me in. Not even these violent impulses give me the strength I need to open the armoire! What is wrong with me? I'm too upset to even think straight. I hate her so much. It's finally sinking in. She's not coming back. Nothing in this cabin will ever change again unless it's by my hand. We don't have any more light bulbs. Ja, das hast du sicher dir selber zu verschreiben. I'm sick of this thing anyway. We're chipping away at what little money we have because of a piece of junk. All of this these pathetic souvenirs from our relationship, they're all lies. How could I be so inconsiderate? Did this stupid lamp destroy my marriage? I, 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 I will fix it, in case she comes back. Ich glaube nicht, dass die Lampe schuld ist an deiner zerbrochenen Ehe. I haven't got any bulbs on me, and I didn't bring any tools. It, wait, what am I thinking? Why am I worrying about a stupid lamp? The stains on this bed suddenly make me mad. Why must life always end up so sordid and hateful? I'm not crawling in there. I'm too riled up for that and it's it's just not dark enough anyway. I couldn't care less about this damn thing. All the real color faded from it long ago. That incessant noise! I should smash this useless antique to pieces right now! Yeah, how is it? It can't keep the time for five minutes straight. Chimes completely at random and never stops making that infernal noise. But hey, guess who thought it was so cute? <laughs> yeah, this is. <laughs> this thing has caused me more sleepless nights than I care to remember. No wonder I'm going crazy. Ich würde die Lampe auch über den Jordan schießen. I torture myself trying to remember. Why must I always be the one to fill the damn pitcher? When did the place get so out of hand? I hate dust and so did she, but here's a whole freaking cake of it. If I kick the nightstand, the dust would billow up and swallow me like a desert storm. I'm too upset to even think straight. I hate her so much. Sunlight, bird song. Nothing feels worse when there's no hope. No, no chance. chance of anything. The light is so dim here. Makes me want to chop down every tree outside. Where are you going? Oh, that's rich. Just run away. I just needed to blow off steam to be somewhere else. Just for a while, but I, I can't even remember what we argued about, unless she was the one who left. All of this, these pathetic souvenirs from our relationship, they're all lies. I tried to flush these a long time ago, but someone noticed, as if she cared about my impotent life. Yeah. High blood pressure, what a load of bull. I've never felt better in my life. I'm sick and tired of having to pamper you like a baby. Fine, I hope you have a great, lonely time at the hospital. I couldn't care less about this damn thing. Sie wollte ja nur das Beste für dich. How could I have been so blind? Her vanity. Always fixing her hair before bed. Doting on her hair like a child. But I'm... I'm being unfair. Would I have wanted her to be some frump? Ugh, I'm too angry to even care. All she cared about was herself all along. Her needs, her feelings. That's all that ever mattered to her. But what about mine? I want to torture myself trying to remember. I'm too upset to even think straight. I hate her so much. I can't even bear to look at my face. She's really done a number on me. She never descended to criticizing my looks, though. Even when we fought, even when my hairline started going. It was a sore point for me. So, mal hier nachsehen. Dearest, 
How do I say any of this? I like your way with words, but if I don't write this, I don't know what I'll do. My life feels so unreal now, dreamlike, but wonderfully so. Let me try, even if clumsily. The hours I spent with you when we last met are precious to me. I was so lost such a short time ago. Everything seemed drained of color and feeling. I think we were meant to find each other, to bring meaning to our lives again, make sense of the confusion shrouding both of us. When we stepped into the crystal silence of the snowy woods, away from the chatter of the guests, all nature seemed expectant, as if holding its breath, witnessing a rare moment of something infinitely better than what life in the ordinary run of things has to offer. Do you remember how the light crust of the snow glittered in the reflected light of the country house? How the copse of trees in which we walked was haloed with a magical aura? I felt the chill of the night air, and you opened your coat and enfolded me in your arms, and we hugged tight, sharing the warmth, sharing the only thing any of us have to share on this earth when you think about it. Hier gibt es nämlich, so denke ich, eine zweite Seite. And then you toppled us on the snow, you devil. We laughed and rolled around, my head already spinning from the wine and crisp pure night air and the stillness all around. We lay back and I guess when I realized what I was seeing. The luminous starscape, like a vast velvet cloth sprinkled with powdered sugar, like it can only be seen in the countryside. I had tears in my eyes when I turned to you and we kissed, and it felt like the only moment in all of time, or outside time, and ours was the only spark that could ignite the universe. You gave me these moments. You complete me in ways I never knew to dream of. Let me be the one who makes sense of the confusion whenever you feel lost again. We can make our own world against the rest of the world if need be. Together we can silence all the demons, heal all the wounds. I love you. In eternity yours, Serena. Ja, sie liebte ihn anscheinend. Über alles. I know what's inside this thing. I just need to set it down somewhere where I can sit down and open it. Ah, we have ja noch the Juwelen box. Ich weiß schon, wo wir uns hinsetzen. This armchair. This is where we had that talk. That damn. I've been trying so hard, but we lost something along the way. Did you get my letter? Will you just listen to me for once? God, you're always... Wait, where are you going? Don't walk away from me. All of this... These... Pathetic souvenirs from our relationship. They're all lies. I couldn't care less about this damn thing. I feel like throwing this chair through the window. But that would just make me even angrier. Her favorite chair, huh? I should just smash this thing to pieces. Oder du könntest dich draufsetzen und die Juwelenbox öffnen. It's wobbly and off balance, just like she was, especially that night. Oh, sie sieht ja da ziemlich wütend aus. She's angry now. Part of me realizes I should be more shocked by this, but for some reason I just feel numb beyond it. She was lying to me and manipulating me all the time. Why did I let her do that? I'm the one who should have been scowling. She played me like a harp and made me look like a complete idiot. Why torture myself trying to remember? I'm too upset to even think straight. I hate her so much. So, jetzt ist die Frage, wie öffne ich die Box? All of I couldn't care less about this damn thing. Why torture myself trying to remember? Her wedding ring or mine? But what is it doing here? Oh, please, no. Ihr Ehring ist da. Oder ist das seiner? It's hers. I can't believe she would just leave it here. Where the hell is she? No. It can't be true. No. No, I didn't do it. 
I need to wake up from this nightmare. I'm too upset to even think straight. I hate her so much. I hate her so much. I remember how happy these made her. She smiled. That wonderful smile. I must have gifted these to make amends or something. Or did I? Did I ever gift her anything? She loved her trinkets more than she loved me. Right? Ich glaube nicht. All of this, these pathetic souvenirs from our relationship, they're all lies. I couldn't care less about this damn thing. Why torture myself trying to remember? I'm too upset to even think straight. I hate her so much. I hate her so much. So, weiter geht's. Hier können wir leider nichts tun. Aber vielleicht der Kasten. My God! What is this? It can't. Don't worry. It isn't. We spent much time here. How did it happen? I can't remember. It's already rotten beyond recognition. But how much time has passed? It's dry and withered. A body takes at least weeks to... How, how long has it been? I can't even remember how I did it. Maybe I didn't. Do I have brain damage? Honestly, I wouldn't be surprised. Those noises sound like more than one person. Who can it be? The police? Are they coming for me? I deserve it, but I want to see who it is first. There's something about those voices. I must know. The window. Do you realize how stupid this was? We had a plan. I took measures to ensure nothing like this would happen. But no, you couldn't help your damn self. We can't risk moving it now. The bulldozers are coming any minute. Fire will do it. Do you think they will buy it after all this time? It's been months since you... Don't worry. It's all covered. He spent much time here. Fine. Give me the kerosene. Oh, sie brennen uns gleich. Die Bude weg. Oh shit! We forgot your... Fuck! It was so stupid to leave it. Why did you do that? Can you calm down? I couldn't bear to wear it any longer. It's in a safe place. We'll pick it from the ashes. No. No! Not like this! No. Ja, eine sehr schöne Geschichte, eigentlich und auch ziemlich schrecklich zugleich. Ich hoffe, ihr hattet Spaß mit diesem kleinen Spiel. Ihr könnt es jederzeit selber spielen. Wie gesagt, es ist kostenlos auf Steam erhältlich. Ich muss sagen, es hat mich teilweise ziemlich mitgenommen. Es war ein Auf und Ab der Gefühle. Ja, einmal etwas anderes. Und freue mich auf mehr Spiele dieser Art.